How's it going? Yeah, I'm Irish. Can you tell by the tan? <laughs> a lot of people here still think of Ireland as a backward nation full of drunks and leprechauns. <laughs> That's just not true. There's no such thing as leprechauns. Yeah. yeah, we're fond of a Guinness or two. Hundred. <laughs> you know, in Ireland, a workaholic is someone who shows up at the office drunk and still gets the job done. <laughs> I know we're not backward. But since I've lived here, I have enjoyed many of your modern conveniences. Like peeing indoors. <laughs> That's brilliant. <laughs> and I love the way the milk comes. Already squeezed out of the cow. <laughs> Into a little box. That's luxury. That's living. <laughs> no, but when I came to the South, I realized you guys talk funny. <laughs> so I decided to learn the language. I bought a course called Rosetta Stone. front of the box it said, learn to talk, you some good Georgia. <laughs> it went like this. Repeat after me. I am making breakfast. No, that's what it said on the tape. <laughs> I'm a fixing to go to Waffle House. She is a virgin. Damn, that girl can run faster than her cousins. <laughs> Go dogs. <laughs> Am I getting it? I'm getting it. So I had an idea for Toyota. I think they should build cream pies right into the airbags. <laughs> this is kind of fun. So ladies, I think I've discovered the true meaning of endless love. Two blind guys playing tennis. <laughs> Speaking of endless love, my wife and I just celebrated five years of married bliss. Don't applaud, we've been married for 12. <laughs> so I hate stereotypes. 
But there's a bunch of Indian guys in my office. And they stink out the break room every lunchtime. I don't know what they're cooking in there. I'm afraid to ask. Even the microwaves are going. Oh God, what's that smell? Jeez, I'm going to be sick. And microwaves are committing suicide. <laughs> These guys are always picking on me. Mr. Irish Jerry, <laughs> you've broken your computer again. <laughs> you are a very bad man. Very bad man. I cannot be fixing your computer until you tell me the magic password. I'm not doing it. Come on, Mr. Irish Jerry. Do it. All right, they're always after me, lucky charms. And the dance, come on. I'm not fixing until you're doing until you are dancing. You dance, I fix. Ta-da is that me lucky charms. I'll tell you though, these guys at least they work hard. There's some guys in my office, real slackers. One of them called me last week, he said he was sick. I said, Yeah, how sick are you? He said, right now I'm in bed with my sister. <laughs> that is sick. <laughs> so last week I went to get life insurance and the nurse said to me, I'm going to need to see a sample of your blood, your urine, and your feces. I went, here, take my boxers. <laughs> Sort it out. I told her, I bet you find a few lucky charms in there. They're always after me, lucky charms. All right, I'm done. Thank you. Irish Jerry, let's hear it for our lucky charms.